Do you want to know, ironically, who? You make me absolutely sick. Today we're going to talk about a topic that can be confusing for a lot of people. It's a big topic, but we're going to make it easy to understand and have a good laugh along the way. We'll be reacting to a video that caused a lot of confusion online, especially the way a biological woman was acting in front of a biological man. So let's dive straight to the video. Been nothing. There is no bravery in wearing dresses and makeup. Women do it all the time. Only in this people's clown world that normal female actions and traits are deemed something extraordinary i figured when i were you born this way or not i am confused if you were born this way why would you need to change yourself with surgeries to become something else and isn't being a woman a social construct if yes then uh, why would you find the need to change yourself to look like a typical biological woman because deep down you know what a woman is and you try your best to look like one <laughs> try to get access to our children to brainwash and confuse them you are the only ones that can't stop promoting adult books to children and teaching them about what's happening inside their pants that's not your job that's the parents the only persons that have the right to influence the children are the parents stop with your propaganda in schools and we'll stop talking about you but don't worry will teach our children morality to combat your lack of it. Especially our Muslim children, you'll never be able to confuse them because Islam is way more powerful than any fantasy you want them to believe in. We have the evidence, no one can dispute the evidence, we heard the evidence, we saw the evidence. <laughs> Why is she fake crying? What is going on in this world? This is some bad action. They want us to sympathize so bad with him. I don't know, did he survive a near death experience or was he kidnapped? I'm totally confused. Is she crying because he's so brave to how creepy she looks right now? You understand how much acting they are doing. She's trying so much to appeal to the LGBTQ community and he is trying so bad to ban that sexually assault woman and during his court trial he claims being a woman and being sent to female prison. Women and children suffer the most from this craziness. To Allah belongs the dominion of the heavens and the earth. He creates what he wills. He gives to whom he wills female children and he gives to whom he wills males. Or he makes them both males and females and he renders whom he wills barren. Indeed, he is knowing and competent. Of course everybody deserves respect. And if I meet a trans person in public, I wouldn't insult him or anything. If not, I show him more kindness. The thing that infuriates me the most is the targeting of children. That's why you should watch this video where I expose Jeffrey Marsh's creepy content targeting children and trying to get them to go no contact with their parents. Thank you for watching. Assalamu alaikum.